if for this thing we have 60 batches, what will happen in a big game? Before we start, guess how much I can optimize this scene? Welcome back to Better Every Time. Today we're gonna learn about Sprite Atlas. We'll start by going to the package manager and in the Unity registry, search for Sprite. Let's import the 2D sprite shape package to our project. Now we can right click create 2D and sprite atlas. In different versions this option will appear in different places but it will always be named sprite atlas. Let's name our atlas menu atlas. Let's start by adding sprites to the atlas. We can search for specific sprites but normally we would want to import a folder. Now press pack preview. To make everything in our atlas fit in the same texture, change the max texture size. If you can't see the preview window, make sure to drag it up from the bottom of the screen. If you want, you can change things like the padding, compression and angle of the images. Just don't forget to press pack preview after. Let's create a script and call it sprite from atlas. In this script, we will load the images from the atlas to the sprite renderer. Let's start by importing the Unity Engine.u2d and Unity Engine.ui. Let's create a Sprite Atlas variable and a string field to hold the image name. For this example, we won't be needing the update function, so we can just delete this. On start, we'll get the sprite from the image component and change its image from the atlas.getSprite function using the image name. Now apply the script to every object in the scene with the sprite atlas and the correct name. Don't forget to remove the source image from the sprite and press play to make sure everything works. Before we finish, you obviously really want to see how much I improved my game. So after implementing the sprite atlas, I didn't see any change and I didn't understand why. And I wasn't about to lie to you. And then I remembered to do the most important thing. Go to edit and in the project settings, in the editor, change the sprite packer mode to always enabled to see the results. Now we can actually see some results. Using something like four sprites, our batches number went to a half. Imagine what you can do to your game. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, dislike, comment. Hope to see you in the next video. Bye!